Today I want to talk about ways to display artwork as gifts and so some affordable art ideas that you guys can get your friends. Today I want to talk about ways to display artwork and so some affordable art ideas that you guys can get your friends. Hey guys, so my name is Felicia Fallum. I'm an artist and traveler and creative person. I do a lot in my community and I'm working on a couple different art projects overall that I'll be vlogging about the next few months. So I, uh, today I want to talk about ways to display artwork and so some affordable art ideas that you guys can get your friends for the holidays. And I think a lot of artwork can be very expensive, especially for originals. And I think that there's, it, it's important that those prices are like, that we respect those prices of artists. But also things like prints and smaller originals are things that oftentimes you can afford and give to your friends and family. Or you can make them yourself. Um, so I'm going to talk about some ways to display them and ways to maybe group smaller pieces to make a display. So here's just a couple that I have and I'll show some photos and switch to voiceover later on in this video. This is just a little easel and these I made a bunch of ornaments so I had the wires hanging on these. This one doesn't have it anymore but I can easily put it back on for Christmas if I give it as a gift or if I do. I might play around more with it. I kind of like the idea of adding something to it. I, I thought it was finished but I don't, I don't think it is anymore. You guys have, a lot of you have seen my women figures. I do a lot of these women figures. They came from a trip in India. I need to make a video about those still, so maybe I will soon, because I haven't yet. But I do a lot of the same kind of image, uh, whether it's women or women and children. You can see these ones. And these ones I sell for $7 for the little ones, but these are little small ones. And so I'll show you, show you guys some photos. These are 4x4, four four, I believe, and then there's like 5x7, and a couple different sizes. I'll show some photos of them. You guys can see how I group them, how I display them as well. So as you can probably tell, I like to display art pieces in little groups. A lot of times I'll use three. Threes tend to be uh, one of my favorite numbers, but also odd numbers. I arrange the odd number of pieces in both symmetrical and asymmetrical patterns. I also like to stick artwork on shelves and mix it in with books. Another technique that I use is picking a theme and sticking to it for a shelf or on a display of some sort. You can see I've done travel themed displays several times. The final tip that I'll share is using artwork as a focal point. It is a great way to stick a large piece in the center of a room or make it something that everybody gets to see and enjoy. I've posted several new display ideas up on Instagram, so be sure to check that out for more ideas. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video about how to hang artwork and display artwork, especially affordable art for the holidays, be sure to subscribe. I make art videos on Tuesdays and other videos throughout the week. Also, if you have questions, feel free to ask them down below.